Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Symfony. Our viewer is looking to enhance their command line application by integrating the Symfony console component, but they face a challenge. How to use Symfony console with dependency injection without relying on the full Symfony framework bundle. Let's dive into the details of their situation. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To use Symphony Console with dependency injection without the framework bundle, we first need to create a command class. This class will extend the command class from the Symphony Console component. Next, we need to set up the dependency injection container. We'll create a simple container using the Symphony dependency injection component. This allows us to manage our services effectively. Now, let's register our command in the container. We will define the command as a service and inject any dependencies it needs directly into the constructor. Finally, we need to create an application instance and add our command to it. This is where we will run the command line application. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. You can use Symfony Console with dependency injection without the full framework. Start by creating an entry script. First, include the autoload file and use the necessary Symfony components. Next, create a container builder instance and register your console command as a service. Add any dependencies your command needs, compile the container, and then create the application. Finally, add your command to the application and run it. You can also configure the container using YAML, XML, or PHP. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To use Symfony Console with dependency injection without the Symfony Framework Bundle, you can create a standalone application. Start by setting up a project with Composer. This setup supports auto-wiring and auto-configuration for your commands and services. You can find a sample command that receives the container in the project. For more details, check out the source code available on GitHub. Happy coding! And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. Now until next time, I hope you have a good day and see you then. Cheers!